Hey guys, what's going on? Pete with Auto Repair Tips. In this video, we're doing a product review at a company called Super Clean. They contacted me about looking at their products. I said, send them to me. They sent me three different types of cleaners. One is for your floor, cleans oil and antifreeze off the floor. One is for cleaning auto parts. If you're working on your car and you have grease on your parts, it cleans that off, it's a degreaser. And one is for your car rims. If you're washing your car and you need to clean your rims off. So we're gonna put them to the test. All right guys, let's get into it. The first one we're gonna take a look at is the floor cleaner. This is for cleaning oil and antifreeze off your driveway or your garage floor. I'm gonna take some oil, I'm gonna put it on the floor, take some of the cleaner, pour it over top of it, and let's see what it does. After it sat about a minute, I grabbed some of it to see what it felt like. You could definitely feel it was working. You could still see there was some residue down there, so I took a broom to kind of help it along a little bit to see what would happen. On the first try, the cleaner took up most of the oil, but there was still some there, so I put a second coat on it to see how that would do. The second coat took up just about all of it. To get the last little bit, you could just use one of their degreasers. Overall, it's a pretty good product. I think it'll work just fine in someone's home garage. All right, guys, if you enjoy these type of videos, consider subscribing, and don't forget to hit that like button. Also, if you'd like to try any of these products I'm going to show you today, I'll put a link in the description below. Anything you order from those links, a small portion does go to help the channel, and I appreciate that. The next thing we're going to look at are the degreasers, and one of them really stood out. Make sure you watch this video all the way to the end so you can see which one of these degreasers I'm going to start using in my shop. All right, the first one we're going to be looking at comes in a squirt bottle. And according to the directions, you spray it on the part, let it sit a few minutes, and rinse it off. The first part we're going to be cleaning is a fuel pump, and it's off a 1978 model Lincoln. And being an original part, it had some caked on grease. Normally we use a scrub brush to kind of help it along a little bit, but in this case I just wanted to see what this product could do on its own. So I put a few coats on it, let it sit a little bit, and then rinsed it off. I was really surprised how it took the grease off. I mean, I didn't expect it to get it all, especially where it was caked on really thick. I mean, I can understand that, but where it was caked on just moderately, it took it off pretty good. But I tell you what, where it did clean that aluminum, you could read the words where it said made in the USA. This is one that I would definitely use in my shop or my home garage, but it's not my favorite one. The next one we're going to take a look at is the same kind of cleaner, but it's just in a foam form. One of the things I like about this product so far is there's hardly any odor at all. This next product we're going to test on a 1968 Mercury flywheel. You use this one the same way. You spray it on, let it sit a little bit, and wash it off. I really don't like how this one sprays out of the bottle. It's kind of hard to get a good coverage on the part. I mean, I get why they did it. The foam does stick to the part better. And just like the last one, I'm not going to use a scrub brush. I'm just going to let it sit and see how it does on its own. After giving it a good coating, I let it sit a little bit and spray it off with cold water. It did a really good job cleaning it off. I just didn't like how it came out of the bottle when you were spraying it on the part. Just took too much of an effort. But everybody's different. You may like that style. The last degreaser we're gonna look at comes in an aerosol can. I like how it sprays. I like how it foams up on the part and it has the same cleaning power. I went out back and grabbed an old rack and pinion off a of Dodge Durango. Just look how when I spray it on this part, it gets in every corner and every crack and just foams up. It's a lot less effort. And watch how it washes this grease away after it sets a few minutes. In my opinion, when you sprayed the part down with this cleaner, it got into more areas, which cleaned the part better. And when you're done with that job, and it's time to clean your tools, hands down, this is the better one to use. So without me telling you, I'm pretty sure you can guess which one I'm going to be using. Alright guys, thanks again for watching. Catch you later.